this is the Henshin device that they will use this and it's called the DX Lube Gyro is here. Okay. So this year the, the this Ultraman uh, lubes and they going to use the, these items and then uh, use that, you know, what they call the lube crystals. And so crystals are inside here and so a uh, Talo crystal and Ginga crystals. Okay, so the two of them are here. And they introduced that at the same time, uh, like, uh, you know, this items, and this is the DX Lube Crystal Set 01. So I can see the G, the primitive style. Okay. And 7 Crystal is here. Sorry for the reflections. And Black King Crystal. Okay, we have the uh, Kaiju one as well. And so Gurujio, Gurujio Bone Crystals. Okay. So, uh, you know, it looks like they're going to introduce the more crystals later on and so expand the world of the uh, Ultraman Louvre and we'll stick with that, okay? So, this is the box, okay? So, see that? This is my hand, so you can see pretty much, you know, a small device. And so, here's the back. Looks like, uh, you know, we get the uh, lots of the different colors, LEDs here as we transform into that. So this is an uh, Ultraman Buru side. Buru is blue here, okay. And this side is a Ultraman Losa. Okay. Now we have to be familiar with the the two separate heads, should I say? <laughs> okay, two thorns, and then with the, this interesting V-shaped head and Ultraman Losa. And so uh, Buru has the single thorn like this. So more like a traditional Ultraman looks like, you know. So we have to be familiar with the, these names, Bulu and Losso. And they also uh, switch down the, their power with their, but by exchanging the, these, you know, crystals. So they, their color also will be changed. Kind of confusing. I already confused that in this, you know, uh, the first episode. So uh, I'm sure you guys are kind of okay, but uh, well, that's something that we have to really remember that. Buru and Lossa. Okay, so let's open this here. Yeah, you know we got a little, you know, <laughs> hassle this morning, and still, and so we didn't have a chance to, you know, do that the quick uh, reviews here, and but uh, this is the very first time to open it. Okay, so uh, we'll see. All right. And then instruction. Okay, so Natsu wa Uru Fesu. All right, good, sounds good. Okay, so Ultraman Festival pamphlets. Okay, so that every summer they have the Ultraman Festival. So this is another kind. Of, it's not a ticket, I guess. It's just a little notice. All right. And little gyro instructions. I'm gonna need that. All right, so let's see. Ooh, that's pretty big. Okay. All right, so this here's their both handles. See that? You know, my adult hand can fit into here. So you, you, you kind of guess that, that this is kind of, you know, very uh, huge, you know, very firm size of the morpher, okay? Here's the location that where the price that, uh, the, all the crystals. Looks like this is a speaker here, okay? All right, and let's go for the crystals. Yeah, I was always one kind of kind of wondered how that are these you know small thorns are stick out. So this is the Ultraman Taro elements, the fire elements. See that? Oh, okay. So that's has a spring inside the. Oh, you can just install that like that. Okay. Ah. okay. 
and just aha aha okay so that's what we do huh all right and one more thing okay so this is a water element Okay, so I can see Ultraman Ginga water elements. All right. So again, the same thing, you just install that of these thorns. And of course, you can just pick it up like this. All right. Ah. You can see the uh, water element color. I mean, I, not that I want water element, but the kanji as well. Okay. Hmm. All right. So it looks like the uh, my you know uh, camera here is kind of you know uh, going you know uh, out of focus and just a little bit lags. Let me just make sure that you know my. Let me bring that on the cameras. Yeah, let me change down my camera to be uh, something a little bit more better. Okay, one second. All right, and let me just activated my camera here. Mm. Okay, so let me just change that my camera to the next one. Probably this one is much better. Uh, so yeah, stay with me and with that. Okay, and you can actually suffer. Let me just connect to the uh, battery so I don't lose that power. Okay, hooked. All right, so let's go. All right, so first we need to get the batteries. It says that it requires three AAA batteries. And so I brought that, almost brand new. And it's on the back. Oh, there, right here, okay. So we use that some kind of uh, ballpoint pen or something like that. Not the needle, there you go. Okay, three of them. Here's one, two, and three. Okay, the battery power installed. And here's the power switch. So let's see what's gonna happen with the power on. All right, so, um, Let's see. Okay, this one. There we go. All right. That's pretty loud. Pretty loud. Okay. So it's kind of nice that it, it stands like that. You know, it's pretty easy to display. Uh, I, 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 that's kind of you know good point. Uh, many of the uh, you know the morphers are used. 
on the the body, you know, on the wrist watch, or you know, on the back goal. Uh, this one, you know, it, it's okay. It's a DG, those are the morphers, right? But you know, as a collector, we need to we like we really like to show off the, the IT collector the items and put it in the shelves and see what they look like as always. All right, so this one is it's a pretty good, you know, stands like this. I like I already like that. That's pretty good. Okay. That's kind of nice stand way you know stands out. Now uh so the river is here, the cover, dokoban. Okay, it looks like a sense of the, what they call the dokoban moving light plates is here inside. I can attach that. And so the lube gyro, how to hold it, and this is the uh okay, how you hold hold it this one. Okay. Cool and it turns all right so you already see that you know inside of the plate is the disc is turning can you see it yeah okay so it's already seeing that you know inside here let's try that and okay first we need to do that the lube crystals all the thorns are installed inside like this Alright. The cover needs to be closed like this. Aha. Uh -huh. Nice. Okay. And okay, it's 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 closed it and lost so tiny devils. Okay, so lost so okay. Let's use that. Oh I see. So they use that the the one thorn is rosa. No, no, sorry. This is for bull. And but the two thorn, this is for rosa. Okay. So uh, the same thing goes with this uh, that other crystals. Okay. Here's the uh, uh, the the thorn in, in the center, and this is for the uh, ro uh, bull. And but when you switch it. You get two thorns, and this is for the uh, rosso. Okay, so that's something that we have to just remember that you know to pray with this one. Okay. All right, and who needs to pull the lever as we install it, and then I pull that the levers three times. Says. Okay. Huh. All right, so let's do that uh, here, and let me. Start with Lube Crystal Rosetto. Okay, let's go with the uh, Losso. So, no, uh, two thorns. Okay, two thorns, right? All right, Lube Crystal Rosetto, she. Okay. Okay, so we will just place this here in the center. Oh! The light is so beautiful. Okay, so I, ho I hope you can see that in more details here. And let me just show you that one more time. It was a different angles. Okay, so let's use that the disc cameras to show you the uh, uh, different angles here. And now, after the uh, transformations, we uh, then we go to the hisat attack one. Okay. And now we use that the Ginga Crystal, Ginga Crystal, and then this uh, Ultraman Losso Aqua mode. Okay. So pull the lever. And waiting for that next actions. And one more time.
it says Sprashu Bomb. Okay, Sprashu Bomb. So that was the uh, Ginga Crystal. I'm using it. And Ultraman Rosso Aqua Foam, should I say? Okay. And uh, also, same time, three polar levers, three levers. Okay. Now, let's go with the, uh, uh, this time with the, uh, uh, the Ginga, but the bull situation. We, we close this. Take that. Okay, and we just install that, you know, those thorns again. And let me just switch to the uh, my front cameras. Here we go. Okay. Oh no, not that one. <laughs> so this one here. Okay. All right. So let's try that. You know, the single thorn here, and this is I'm using a Ginga crystal and bull. Okay, bull. All right. So I would install this one here in the center. Three times. Okay, so uh, Ultraman Blue Aqua, it says. Ultraman Blue Aqua. Okay, and transformed. Now next, uh, let's try out the Hisat attack as well. And now again, we are with the Ginga Crystals and in a single thorn, now we are Ultraman Bow Aqua now. And pulled out the rivers three times for the Hisat attack. So, Aqua Studium, Aqua Studium, it says. All right. Okay, so now I, I start to understand. So, we use that Aqua uh, no, Ultraman uh, Ginga Crystals. Okay. Next, let's use that Talo. Okay. I like the Talo. <laughs> I grew up with him. You know. So, let's go use that Talo Crystals and Losa. So, uh, two two thongs okay now let's try this here and put it on here one minute hold on can you see it all right oh and close it first okay so tallow and ultraman uh it's a loss of situation loss of, okay So Ultraman uh, Buru Frame. No, sorry. Ultraman Bosso Frame. <laughs> okay, that's not to be mixed with it, but the yeah, Ultraman Losso Frame. Okay. Now, uh, as we are using uh, Ultraman Talo crystals and on the uh, frame, and let's go with the uh, the Hisat attack. Okay. So again, the three times. Now, the turning disc is pretty now nice with the LEDs and also the center of the crystals which has a light okay so that's pretty good and that was the uh, uh, Taro crystal and on the Ultraman Rosso frame frame Sophia shoot frame Sophia shoot it says okay all right so that was the uh, 
the uh, loss of frame. Now let's go with the Uterman bull frame. Okay, so same crystal and single thorn. Now you are Uterman bull frame. Okay. Now we close this and do the hand sheets. Okay. Actually, I like it. <laughs> okay, that's a beautiful color, and I really like it. It's great. And now, uh, actually, the, this is the, the basically what the instruction says. And we did that uh, tarot crystals, and now we use that. Uh, here we go, the bull. And let's go for the uh, hisat attack. Here we go, three more times. Okay, it says uh, frame eclix. Okay, I'm not sure what is the meaning of the eclix. Okay, do you guys know? Eclix, never heard of that. <laughs> okay, so anyway, so frame eclix. That's the exact attack. Uh, now we are on again a Ultraman Talo crystal and we are on a Ultraman Bull frame. And we just did that his attack. Okay. It's called frame eclix. So I had to say, okay. All right. So yeah, this is the uh, strobe riding effect, and looks pretty good. And so, uh, kind of you know, fun to play with that. All right. So let's see, and uh, what else? Okay. So now, now I like to just take a look at the, just a little bit about details of these items. And so uh, this is a side view. Okay, so um, you know you can see the golden, I mean the silver parts, and here the cover, you know, like this. And you can close it, and when you turn, this is the back side, battery cover, and the speaker is here on the top. Again, the uh, you know the handle is you know uh, is like just like that in front of my adult hands can't fit into this. And so that's a pretty good size. It looks like it's more like a, you know, kind of common lighters, drivers, or Haitian belts, don't you think? <laughs> you know, <laughs> so um, if I if I have the kind of extra belt and I can just, you know, when I can let the belt go through here and make it as a kind of back coat as well. So that kind of be interesting, <laughs> okay? so. It does look like a common light of Henshin belt, but you don't wear it, but you hold it. Okay. All right. So let me just hear that, you know, one more time. Oh, so it's still. Okay. I guess I, I think I screwed it. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Take a look at that here. You can see lots of pins here. And so this is where that, you know, the sounds can activate with this, these pins. Okay. So looks like we have in the center, we have the LED parts and some kind of, you know, signals. Oh, wow. You know, when you look at that here, I don't know if you can see here, the shape of the Ultraman appeared. On that, this white plastic, can you see the Ultraman shape? I didn't realize that. Yeah, there is. So all the Ultraman shape is like that, and also you can see them on the crystal designs as well. So, see that? They're doing the same pose. 
Okay. And on the back of the pin, we can see that all the you know uh, notch over here. One, two, three. And there's nothing here on this side. How about here? Oh, okay. So here's the two, two of them for the uh, tight uh, talo crystals. We only see the two notches here, and but the uh, ultraman ginga crystal has the three of them. So these combinations will be. These are the combinations that you can actually activate the sounds from here. Hmm. Okay. So. This is, a, this is a something, you know, uh, the gyro that we can play with. Okay, so let's see uh, how it works with that, you know, uh, our service, okay? So I'm very excited that we can have the pretty good toys here. And first I was kind of, ex uh, you know, skeptical. And uh, well, it looks fun, you know, good. And then uh, you can be, uh, you know, good collector for the, this, you know, all the crystals. So we'll see what's gonna happen with this, these items, okay? So uh, once again, we did that and we started a pre-order like about, what, a month ago for this. And then uh, so far we sold that in like a, you know, very six of them or something like that, okay? And so uh, that that's it, right? And so uh, the, this coming Sunday, we do not have the extras to sell, okay? So all the pre-order customers will be sending of the, your orders uh, this coming Monday, so uh, please be patient with us. So those of you who are interested in this, and uh, we, if you are interested in uh, get, uh, you know, uh, you want if you want us to get in more of this, please con make sure to contact us, and so we can do just do that, you know, as uh, uh, ordered. Uh, we can send our orders to the our wholesalers for the second wave, or it could be the uh, third wave. Okay. All right, so thank you very much, everyone. Now, we will continue that our live streams and, and demonstration after this. Now, we need to try this here. Uh, Kino Lube Crystal, the Golden Lube Crystal. And so this is a, a kind of you know, premium items. And so just very limited numbers and exclusive items. So we will test that on next videos and in a more of the uh, Lube Crystal. And of course, here we have the Lube Crystal set to try that too after the following the, the, this demonstration. So 